Jenny sleeps through the night, and I hope Teresa is gone by now, because she will certainly use any excuse to weasel her way back into Ethan's life. doing me no that's my line honey and i already know the answer Shh, don't wake jane all right you will stop at nothing to try to get into bed with my husband even use our sick daughter as an excuse she's my daughter gwen gwen i can explain this no don't even bother because i don't blame you this is just another one of her sick little plots look i'm sure you were exhausted from taking care of jane all night and you fell asleep this little bed bug then decides to crawl in next to you add fuel to her fantasy that there's actually something going on between the two of you you have no right. You know, it actually makes me queasy to think of how you get your cheap, sick thrills. You don't have any idea what's going on. Oh, I know exactly what you hoped would happen. You thought I would come home from work and find you all snuggled up in my bed next to Ethan, and that I would think that you two had sex behind my back to prove your theory that Ethan still loves you. Teresa, this is sad. This is so incredibly sad. When you think about it, you know, because I know my husband, Ethan loves me. He doesn't love you, and I'm not going to buy into your perverted little fantasy life. I know that this is 100% you and 0% Ethan. And get your bony ass the hell out of here. 